Hey YouTube, I want to talk to you guys about this rigid, easy change faucet tool. I just purchased this thing to change out a sink you see that I have here. I just want to go over what I like, what I don't like about this tool. So let's first look at what it says on the packaging. Now you can get this tool at on Amazon, from Home Depot, at Lowe's, but uh, probably come quicker if you can get it off of Amazon. I'll have the link in the description. It says Easy Change Faucet Tool. You can see the different images it has here. Reaches under the sink. I mean, this all looks nice, but until you actually put this thing to use, you don't realize how beneficial it is. Let's look on the back. You see all these different little, little <clears throat> drawings and saying what it's used for. Three fourth inch uh, bolts, nuts. Um, you turn your your faucet valve. Uh, these little knob things. Now this is that uh, used to secure the sink. This is pretty neat. I'm gonna show you guys how I use that. Uh, if you look like if you're changing out a tub. It has a tool for that, which I didn't need yet, but I'm sure it'll come in handy. Uh, yeah, so this is pretty neat. I really haven't used this part yet. So I guess when I'll need it, I, I can see how it would work. I see it fits a five eight inch uh, nut. Now this screwdriver part, I don't know what you would use this for. How, how would this work? But I guess if I ever run across that problem, <laughs> then I'll understand why. But let's let's go over the tool, guys. So you have this handle here. And what I like about it, this handle is pretty firm. Um, it's pretty stout, solid, solid plastic. And what I like, as you can see with this tool, I mean, different parts come out. So this part right here will come out. We'll just push this thing out, pull it out. And it helps with this, with the faucet. So you'll do this and it helps with reaching out because guys, you know, when you're uh, working under a cabinet, under a sink, you're working with in a tight space. So this helps for you to just reach up, slip this thing over it and just start turning. So that's neat. And as opposed to you lying on your back, reaching up with your hand and trying to turn this thing all it, normally it'll be way up here. So you really have to stretch to get this thing off. But look at the reach on this thing. It's pretty long, so um, that was beneficial. And this is really, really helpful. So I like this part of it. This is pretty neat. You see it has the little grooves in it to grab this little knob. So that's pretty cool. But guys, what I love most about this tool is this part here, this little. Now this slides out also, which is pretty neat. And this is for the hoses, for your hoses. And they have the grooves that'll fit either the quarter inch or whatever size you guys have, or the, uh, what is it, five eight, I think. And what I like about it, again, when you're inside of a cabinet, look how sharp this is, as opposed to when you're normally changing out hoses or faucets under a cabinet with your sink, you have to use this crescent wrench, guys. Now look at the length between these two. Now you can imagine you're gonna hit all kind of stuff with this crescent wrench. And this is shorter, guys. Look how much area this covers. And then with the crescent wrench, it always slips. The, the, the tool slips and you have to keep readjusting your crescent wrench to fit around it. And then when, cause remember these hoses have two different sizes. So, um, it's, you have to adjust your wrench for each size, but this thing is, uh, look how easy it, this is. Well, let's grab the hose. Look at this, it fits right over it, guys. So you would put this part in and look at that, look how it fits, guys. Smooth as silk, and you can just turn it and it just fits in, say your hose is like this under your sink. You just put this in with your hand and start turning. Easy, I mean, that's that's worth the price of admission right there, guys. And I think this tool is like 20 bucks, so it's pretty cheap. Uh, this is a 5 8 inch size, I believe. And look at this, guys, how it fits this size also. It's this side. Yep. And look at that, guys. 
And like I said, you could turn this with your hand, guys. So this is, I mean, this is awesome. I love it just for this part. And if you need extra leverage, you just snap this in. And you can, it fits around the pipes if you need. I mean, like I said, you need extra space. If, it, if you have to do it like this, flip it to get around the holes. You just put it in and start turning, guys. So I love this tool. I highly recommend it. Just for the time it saves you, it makes your life much easier. Just this little piece right here that fits over the holes, this, this, this is worth it, as opposed to fighting with the crescent wrench. So uh, that's the rigid easy faucet change tool. I love it, guys. I highly recommend it. Again, I don't know what this other part is used for. I know one part is for changing out uh, the tub drain, but... I guess as I'll go on, I'll figure out what it, what it's for. But I love it, guys. I highly recommend it. So check it out. Links in the description. Talk to you on the next video. Bye-bye.